everyone. Good morning, it's Adele. I'm just gonna make sure I can see any comments that are coming on. So give me a second to get my computer connected to this live video. Um, it's just a reality of Facebook that this is what we have to do to make sure we can respond to everybody. And unfortunately, usually my computer has a little bit of a delay. So, um, anyway, I'm here in Austin still, actually in Leander, Texas, at my nephew's house, and I'm getting ready to chalk this morning. Uh, last night I went shopping at Goodwill and found some really cool things. And so last night I worked and painted them with some spray chalk paint. Now, I love Chalk Couture's boards, and I highly recommend them. But this is a gift for a friend, and I didn't want to spend a lot of money because um, I just didn't. She would understand that because she's very thrifty. So I am going to do something that I know she's gonna love. And it's something that I, I actually did a search on it and could not find it anywhere in, um, <clears throat> in the Google Land. You know, I trust the Google Land and there was nothing anywhere that's, that showed pictures of this project done. I, I saw one picture. Actually, one picture, that's not true. I saw one picture and it was on a pillow. So I am going to chalk on a board that I repurposed last night. So um, here it is. I'm just gonna bring it down and show you. So you'll see the, the table more than me doing this. So this is the board that I found. Let me turn on one more light, hold on. It'll help with the shadows a little bit. Might help, it might not. I think it helped a little bit. <clears throat> so this is the board, and I spray painted it. Now I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to use the inside too because it's made of wood. Hey Dee, good morning. Because it's made of wood, I think I can use both sides of this. And since it's a gift, why not? So. My friend love cat, loves cats, and this is the GeoCat transfer that uh, Chalk Couture has. Now, I'm not gonna be able to get it all on here, but I may be able to put some on the front and some on the back. Uh, so, the first thing you do is, I've already got colors ready. She likes a lot of color, so these are the colors I've picked for this project. I don't know where I'm going to put them. And actually, let me raise this up because I don't think you can see them all. Yeah, you can see them all now. Okay, so first I'm gonna de-stickify and that means I'm gonna put it on my clothes to try to make it so it won't pull off the paint that I sprayed on last night. And that's just a matter of, oops, and not letting it fold over on itself, which I just did. <laughs> That's funny. Give me a handy wipe to fix that. So if it sticks together, you can just take a little handy wipe and pull it over. Usually, I folded it pretty tight, so I think it's done, but it's okay. It's not on any, any of the parts I need. So I'm still de-sticking it. My biggest question here is, do I put the cat on the side? in the center or over here. I, I kind of like it on the side. I think it looks cool there. Well, I feel a little something there. Hold on. I had my glasses two seconds ago. Wow, that's funny. I have my glasses literally two seconds ago and now I can't find them. Um, I'm trying to decide where to put this on the board. They're not on my head though. Oh, I see them. Hold on a second. doesn't cause a bubble. I felt a little bump. 
my shirt is clean, so I don't know where that bump came from, but whatever. All right. Yeah, on the side is good. I'm gonna put it right here, I think. These are a little angled squeegee and I can just push down on it real good. And then, let's see, I think I'm gonna put, I do what I want up here. And I X the back of my transfer so that I don't accidentally ruin one. I actually had a bike transfer sort of trashed um, because of that. And I'm not sure if it happened to the class or if it was me, but I think it was me. Okay, so there's that. It's gonna bend over a little bit. That might be a little crooked. Oh, I forgot to destick it. <laughs> ah, dear. After all that talk about destickifying, let me try it again. Well, luckily it did not pull any paint up. So that's good. I'll put a little bit of fuzzing on it. Okay, let me see if I can kind of eyeball this. <clears throat> so, how's everybody doing? D, what does it? Is it nice and cool in Oregon? Are you getting rain? What's happening? So I think I'm gonna do the, go ahead and do the um, the cap first because I need to pull this template. Well, maybe I could do it. I want to put the footprints. So it's got cute little footprints, and I want to kind of put them all the way around and kind of go off the board with them. So. Let me think, I think it might be an orange tabby. I think we're gonna do an orange kid. Orange kitty cat. So, this will be pretty fast. 90s in Oregon with no air conditioning, that's gonna be miserable. Well, you have air conditioning. But when I, when I lived in the Northwest, I learned that a lot of people don't have air conditioning. In fact, I didn't have air conditioning. So when it gets above 90 in the Northwest, you are miserable because there is no air. All you get is a fan if you're lucky. So I'm just wiping off the excess. Not very well either, hold on. Making sure there's no lines. I'm gonna pull off. Oh my gosh, that's cool. How come nobody does these? This is really cool. Yeah, they don't need it. It's like an extra thing, you know? But you just don't need it in the Northwest. One more expense, so why, why do it? Maybe in the newer homes they're building, but a lot of the older homes don't have it. Isn't that cute? OMG, check it out. That is adorable. I'm not a cat person, but I like cats. Um, it's, I, I'm just more of a dog person. I absolutely love dogs. In fact, one of, my, I, one of the things I would like to do in my lifetime, if I can, is to uh, build a, uh, a dog rescue. So I'm trying to decide what color to put here. I love lemon in script. What do you think, D? Should I go for lemon? I love lemon. I know you're gonna say yes. I could do purple, or I could do a lemon. Hmm, maybe I'll do purple with, 
for the feet. There's a little bit of delay on my... <laughs> so let's see. I think I'm gonna do lemon. She's probably responded and it just hasn't showed up on my feed. So you wanna make sure you get enough paste in here to give it a good solid amount of paste. And then you just wanna scrape up. Hey Christy, how you doing? I'm not a cat person, I'm more of a dog person, but this is a gift for a friend who absolutely adores cats. She's a cat person, I'm a dog person. But I do love cats. I mean, I don't, I don't hate them, I'm not a hater, is what I'm trying to say. I actually love all animals except snakes. When you live in Arizona, you're kind of trained to be anti-snake. <laughs> we have rattlesnakes everywhere. And uh, I was born in New Mexico and raised in Arizona. So um, me and snakes don't like each other. Boy, Florida is really getting dumped on this year, huh, Christy? Okay, we're gonna pull it off and see what it looks like. Oh my gosh, it just pops off the board. So if you're just coming on, this is a board that I rescued from a thrift store. And I spray painted it last night with chalk paste. And um, I'm actually, my intentions are to try to do both sides. Well, there I got a little mess. Um, to try to do both sides of the board. A little paint dripped off somewhere on the bottom of it. <clears throat> So now I'm going to do the little paw prints everywhere. I kind of want to cut this transfer up, but I don't want to ruin it, so... I can just move the feet wherever I want them to go, I guess. So just to protect the cat, I don't want to pull off any of his paste. I'm going to put that there. Same with the font here. And I'm just doing a real simple project today. I just wanted to see how these repurposed boards would work. Rain, rain, rain. Well, I absolutely love rain. That's why I love living in the Northwest. So yeah, isn't that cute? I love it. It's really cute. I'm gonna put some paw prints randomly around here. Okay, paw prints, purple, green, or blue, or all of the above. I kinda of wanna do a little, huh, I'm gonna try something. Do a little mixture here, see what happens. It may not work, but the joy of this is I can just wipe it off. Get a little purple on the bottom there. Whoops, that one might be a little funky. Now I'm just gonna scrape off the excess. He's gonna be a hippie geocat. <laughs> Not hippie, uh, whatever you wanna call it. I, I love color, so. Missing a little bit in that paw right there. Come on, purple, don't let me down. This is orchid, I love the orchid. You call it the tie-dye effect? Yeah. I better pull it off before it gets too crazy. Oh yeah, look at that. I don't know if you can see that. Let me pull it up. What do you guys think? I love it. <laughs> All right. Let me just uh, put that back. <clears throat> I'll do that again. 
Should I use the same colors or mix it up, do a different combo? Here's my color choices. Sorry, I had to wipe this off. I left too much paste on it, so I'm drying it for a minute. You know how people love their pets. Mix it up. I love you, Christy. Love it. All right, we're gonna mix this bet. Oh, I guess I better protect that. Whoops, almost made a boo-boo. I better dry that. Since I just did it, I better put a little heat to it. Get it to dry. What's the temperature in uh, Florida, Christy, with all that rain? Is it cooled off? Is it like in the 70s? Or is it still like 90 degrees and raining? 100 degrees and raining. Let's see. I love having my friend Christy on here. She, we uh, chalked together at convention and I couldn't have sat by a more perfect person for me. Because her and I just, well, I think we just like to not follow rules. <laughs> so I'm gonna put some lemon in this one. Lemon in the middle, maybe. Ooh, that's a lot of lemon. Let's see what else I do. Orange, okay. Maybe orange and blue. This time I'm gonna try to, on that other one, I was a little shy on paste. Damn, I'm not, I don't care about wasting it. It's not that big of a deal. I'd rather have more in there and do it one sweep than, all right, here we go. Take two. And I'm just watching to make sure I kind of fill up my squeegee and it's working perfectly. Oop. All right. I might just save that squeegee to the side because it's got some goodness on it. And I'm just scraping off the excess. Got a little bit of a oopsie right there. We'll pull it up for you. Can you see, can you guys see that? Let me let me move the comments off my phone so I can see what I'm doing. Am I putting them too close together? I don't think so. But I, what my plan is. Well, thanks for the hearts, guys. I'm thinking about um, just taking them off the board up this way and just kind of like they're walking. What do you think about that idea? Walk the cat off the board. And between each one, I'm just taking my uh, wipes and taking the color off the silk screen. I don't really care about the transfer. I'm really more concerned about the silk screen. <clears throat> I don't know if you can see what I'm doing here. Let me see. Yeah, you can. So, if you can see there, I've wiped off almost all of the paste that I used two seconds ago. Now I'm gonna probably curve this one a bit. Let's see, maybe there. Gotta make sure I don't hit the cat. It's always, oh, oh, oh. Do not hit the last. Okay. Protect my paw prints from before. And I'm just gonna make sure this is pushed down again. The, the dark spots is where the 
silk screen in it, and that's where the paste comes through. Back that off a little bit. Okay. So what did we do before? Purple. I'm gonna mix this one up. I'm gonna do purple, yellow, and orange. That's gonna be weird. We'll try it. Oh, spilled some on. I don't care. I haven't fixed it either. I have not fixed my balloon transfer. I need to get that done. Um, maybe I'll do that today. I just need to redo it completely. What did I say I was gonna do? Purple? I think I'm gonna do purple and yellow. I don't have yellow in a purple yet, so. Yeah, that balloon transfer, we were just too pressed for time. I, I hope they fix that next year. Purple, yellow. And let's see, what else am I gonna use there? Maybe green. I had purple, green, and blue. Purple. I'm trying to figure it out, sorry. <laughs> Should be this hard, Adele. We'll just do green. I love lime. Lime is one of, lime and lemon are two of my favorite colors in the the ones that are going away. So I stocked up on them. Not that they don't have good colors. Anyway that replaced them. Woo, there we go. That's gonna be messy. All right. I have a clean squeegee. I'm just gonna swipe it off. I wish I could get the camera down here to show you what I'm doing. Maybe I can do it this way and tilt it up. So I'm just pulling it with me and I'm going slow And then I'll just do the same thing over here. I'll try to line up my colors and just go really slow. I don't know if you can see what I was doing there, but oops. All right, that one kind of dripped into my purple. All right. I need to scrape it off one more time. smudge there. Look what happened. I think I didn't get enough off. All right, I'm gonna have to redo that foot. That paw. It's usually operator error. It's usually not anything with chalk tour. Usually it's something that we do. It causes the need to repair. So let me show that to you. So I'm just going to go on and um, I'll fix that later. But I'm going to keep moving just because I want to finish this. But I can fix that later. Not a big deal. Hey, Brenda. Whoops. This is what I'm doing, a repurposed board that I got at the thrift store. It's a gift for someone. And I spray painted it last night with some, paint, with some chalk paint. And I'm actually going to do a double-sided gift. I'm going to chalk on the inside of this a little later. But right now, I'm just... I got a little boo boo right there. I can fix that later. I'm gonna dry this transfer because I think that may have played a little bit of a key in it. I may have got it too wet. Let me do one more thing here. I 
think it actually leaked through the other side. I had some paste on it maybe when I put it back down. I don't know what I did, but something it didn't like. So, hey Jolene, how's it going? I'm doing a gift for a friend here. She is a massive cat lover. I think she has, I don't know, it's crazy. I would never have that many cats or dogs. I think she has, I don't know. I don't even want to say, I don't want to embarrass her. She's got a lot of cats. She's a cat lady. Okay. I think I'm gonna do the same thing a little. Um, Christy calls it, uh, yeah, I'm trying to stock up on some of those too, the paste that are retiring and stuff like that. Um, I'm trying to think of what, Oh yeah, a little tie-dye look is going on here. Hey Joyce, happy birthday. Okay. So I still have some paste over here on my squeegee from one of the last times I went. I don't know if I should try that. It's kind of a wild idea. Try to use it again. What do you think? Why not? Let's try it. It worked, okay. We scrape it off. The problem is, will I have enough? Yes, I will, yes. Awesome. Now just to get it off. I think that was a problem last time is I didn't get it off. I didn't clean it enough. Weird, I can't see through that transfer very well. Well, it's working. All right, well, I think I'm done, except for fixing that little spot there. Get this in the water so it can start getting clean. All right, what do you guys think? The tie-dye effect. Thank you, Christy. So I will go on later, hopefully today, and do the inside of the gift. You know, wipe all that paint that I spilled here. Um, like I've said before, I'm not a clean crafter. I make, I make messes everywhere. Anyway, so I'll be back later today to finish off this gift for my friend. If you have any ideas, I will actually think of maybe I'll put a couple of leaves down here, but I don't know if that would be too much. What do you guys think? Should I put a couple of like, Maybe one of those wispy kind of dandelion looking things that are on the, what are they on? They're on one of our transfers. What do you guys think? Not a dandelion, but it's, oh gosh, let me see if I can find it. Hold on. I used it yesterday. Well, I can't find it. It's got like a, anyway, I can't remember what it's called. Less is more, okay, I agree. I think if I put something else on it, it may detract from those cute little paw prints and I don't wanna do that. Well, thank you guys for joining. Remember, if you're interested in learning more about Choc Couture, yes, I can speak. Um, just send me a message. Please like and share this video. It helps all of us in Choc Couture when we do that. And, um, also, there's a shop tab up at the top of my page, and you can try that. But uh, it's been great hanging out with you. Look at my glasses. <laughs> they got the stripes. They're from Dollar Tree. They cost a whole buck. Anyway, thanks. I'm going to chalk again today, maybe a few times. Um, Jody's coming back tonight, so I've got to get some stuff done. Thanks. Talk to you soon. Hey, everybody. If you like this video, please click on the subscribe button and then hit the bell icon. And don't forget to visit my website. Thank you.